Team Manitoba cycling coach Jason Gillespie ramps up the intensity of his team's cycling workout in the tight confines of the Sport Manitoba building. But the training experience for provincial athletes like Gillespie's cyclists is changing. Instead of working out in primarily small spaces like the one they're in here, athletes will soon have new facilities opening at Sport Manitoba like this one, known as the cage. The cage was originally going to be a restaurant and a kitchen and they were it didn't fill and it wasn't working so we commandeered it and we created the strength and conditioning area and uh, it's been pretty innovative for our provincial team athletes and the idea being that our athletes have a place to train for our provincial teams. Those competitors work with Adam Decker on strength and conditioning. He says a number of athletes have come to the cage since it opened on February 10th. Yeah, well, we have uh, a lot of groups coming in and using the facility already. We have uh, cycling coming in, field hockey, badminton, tennis, a bunch of other groups coming in. And, and for some of those groups, I perform the strength and conditioning. Um, for some of the groups, we bring in other, other trainers that they're comfortable working with. And uh, so my schedule is pretty full as far as organizing that and, and, and doing some of the service, service providing myself. Providing training facilities for provincial teams is Sport Manitoba's way of remodeling a system that helped Canadian Olympians raised their game at the 2010 Games in Vancouver. We've taken the own the podium uh, success that was there and we, as, the, as they say, we ripped off and deployed our indeed it and we've dummied it down to a provincial level and we're implementing here. So we're not only doing the planning with the teams, but we're also doing the supporting the team. Also we do all of our power training, strength training, cardio, core, speed agility, quickness, everything that we're trying to do for our athletes we can do in the cage here and in our adjoining studio as well. Bigelow says the cage will eventually be available for club teams, but for now the main focus is Team Manitoba and the 2013 Canada Games. In Manitoba, you know that within 70 miles, we've probably got 70% of our athletes. So to bring them together, that's a huge advantage that big provinces like Ontario, BC, Alberta, and uh, even Saskatchewan, because they've got more urban centres, uh, don't have. So being able to bring our athletes together and train, and also creating a multi-sport training environment is really cool. For Shaw TV, I'm Mitchell Clinton.